Hi everyone, my name is Dr. William Shield with the Orthopedic Medical Group of Tampa Bay. I am a hip and knee replacement specialist and also focus on complex hip and knee replacement as well as revision surgery. Today I would like to talk with you what we look for when we are evaluating an x-ray of your knee to determine if you may be a candidate for a knee replacement. The first thing we look for is joint space narrowing. On this x-ray you can see that there is no more joint space and that these bones are directly in contact with each other. This is what we call bone-on-bone -bone osteoarthritis. The next thing we look for is subchondral sclerosis, which you can see here. This is the dense white bone that forms when you unfortunately develop bone-on-bone -bone arthritis. The next thing we look for are osteophytes. These are also known as bone spurs. You can see these on the x-ray and they look like small spikes of bone on the inner and the outer surface of the knee joint. We also look for subchondral cyst formation, which you can see here. This is when joint fluid forces itself between cracks in the bone and forms these small pits in the weight-bearing surface of the bone, which is also a hallmark of osteoarthritis. Thank you for listening, and if you are experiencing severe joint pain, we look forward to seeing you to determine the best course of treatment for you and helping you get back to an active lifestyle.